Assalamu alaikum, welcome to CS210. So, in this small video, I'm going to show you how do you create a jar file using your NetBeans. So, in the class, we've been studying the link lists. So, this code is available on the GitHub link that I provided on my website. So, what I'm going to do is for this list project, I'm going to create a jar file. This project currently has three packages. So we have the C list packages, which is a circular list package, the dynamic link list, and the, sorry, the double link list, and the single link list. So the jar file I'm going to create, I'm going to link it to the test1.java file, which is inside the DLL, the double link list package inside the list project. So this is how we do it. First, I'm going to look at the properties from a project. So right click, look at properties. Now here under run, under the run options in your categories, you will be looking at main class. So this is where you're going to select your main class. So you can select browse. Now it's looking for all those Java files which contain the main method. So in the earlier implementations, I created a test file for each of those packages. Uh, so for this jar file, I'm going to select the dll.test1. So dll is the name of the package. And inside this package, we have a test1 class. So I'm going to select that and we're OK. Now, again, let's have a look at where the default files would be created. So if you look at the packaging under build option, again, in your project properties, you can see that Beans would be creating your jar file in this directory location. Of course, the root of this directory would be the project directory, wherever you've created your project. So whatever the current project directory, slash this, this is short for distribution, slash let's start dot jar so you can change the properties over here but for now i'm just going to keep it like this now you need to simply go and clean build your project and this should create your jar files let's go and have a look at it so in my machine in my machine i have this project lists under that project i have the source files this source file these are the packages so here is the dll and this contains the java files now i'm just moving up and i can see that there is a dist folder which was previously not there before i compiled and built my project so under dist is the list.jar this is the jar file we were just Create it now. Now let me show you how do you execute this jar file from the prompt. So in Mac, we have the terminal window. In Windows, you have the CMD. So all I did was I just CD, changed my directory to the current project directory. If I do an LS, here you can see the dist folder in my current project directory. So I'll go to this directory. And if I list all my files again, you can see the jar file. So how do we run this? Very simple. Java hyphen jar and the name of your file. There you go. So it simply goes and executes the, the Java program, the program that you've written on this uh, on the screen. If I had done this thing here in NetBeans, I simply go and run it. There you go. It shows the exact same output. So, thank you for watching. This was a small tutorial on how to create a jar file in your computer.